Okay, so Frey alive, and Odin was mad. Furious, and he cuffed her most terribly. After so much time together, he knew her vulnerabilities and exploited them to craft curses she could never break. Oh, like not being able to leave Midgar. Worse still, he robbed her of her warrior spirit. Freya cannot fight, even to defend herself. No living thing may she harm by blade nor spell. In a world this belligerent, what choice does she have but isolation? Poor Freya. I guess if I was her, I'd spit in your face too. I lied. So would I. Come, boy. Boy. Another marker. I need that alchemist for something I'm stewing up for you. If in your smarts, you'll find him. Better not be fighting with your brother again. Just because he's gotten a little less annoying over the years doesn't mean I ain't got a customer base of my own to keep happy. Oh, yeah? Who's that? Well, you came back here, didn't you? Fair point. inside. So, Brock said his friend was dwarven like him, wearing a green ring. Look if you wish. I will be gathering resources for our journey. You want to help him? No. Why not? Because I do not run errands for dwarves. Dwarven, with no ring. One of his crew? Scorch marks. There, along the floor and wall. Weird. I guess we keep looking. We? I mean, I'll keep looking. Some more dangerous than that. Then do not drop your guard. Come.
Joseph. Not him. Hey, I thought you didn't care. I noticed the lack of ring while looting the body. Ah. Oh. No ring. We're not gonna find Brock's friend alive, are we? Find something useful here. Attached to the Soul Eater. Well, we know what happened to Invari now. We can just go tell Brock. No need to fight it, right? No, we will fight it. But why? Because you are frightened of it. Yeah. <laughs> 
we're done here. Strong address. Stay focused and look for a weak point. Yes, sir. Stay quiet. Make no sudden movement. Father, let's see if that's the alchemist ring. Green ring, dwarvish inscription. The alchemist. But well, where's the rest of it? Ashes, most likely. The soul leader got him. I guess we should bring this back to Brock. What does it say? Sir. These runes were written fast. It spells out... Ejim Staney. Hmm. I don't know that one. We will ask the blue one. So now you're interested? We found his alchemist. A reward was promised. Okay, here we go! Oh! <laughs> 
What'd you find? Your alchemist. I'm sorry, Brock. The hand is all we could find. Still wearing the ring. There was a soul eater inside. And well, it must have burned away the rest of him. Suppose you'll still be wanting some compensation, huh? Naturally. Naturally, he says. Miani Ferruxi. <laughs> I'll take a closer look at this here ring. Maybe Anvari left a bit of magic inside before he croaked. Dwarves can do that? Sure, dwarves and magic jewels is like flies and pig lips. Supple ones. Ugh. I'm not as interested as I thought. Oh there. Got another favor to ask you to. What do you want, dwarf? I got another lead on my old pal Anvari. Meet me at the Lawn Soother Mines. There's some fancy dancy loot in it. Another lead? I'll explain it to mine. Pull the ring off on Vari's hand at the Vellander Mines. Feller was always tampering with souls and dark rituals and matters of the night, see? Just the sound of his hammer flattening metal were enough to stoke my fires all blissful. Shit, you better clear out before I get all frisky. What's got you all bum fuzzled over there? Get going! Come. Oh. 